Hey guys, welcome back. So, today I am finally filming what I kept talking about. Uh, what's in my bag for this uh, Steve Madden Speedy Style bag that I found at Marshall's. Um, I ordered it online, but they do sell it in stores too. And then they also have it in like a tote style. Um, so yeah, I just filled her up. I didn't even finish taking off the like... Um, you know, the little hook thingy. Um, I just took the tag off anyway, but, uh, it did come with this little card holder, which you can detach. Um, it has a little clip. I just left it on there just to show you guys, but I am going to put it inside my bag since my credit card and ID are out. I don't like my stuff hanging like that. Uh, but yeah, it's a really beautiful bag. It gives me LV vibes, like they're speedy purses. So, um, I think this was $34.99, like I said, at Marshall's. So, I am just going to open her up. Uh, it also, I guess you guys can tell, it has gold, gold hardware. But I like that when it zips, it doesn't just go straight across. It actually, like, goes down. So, I like that because it, like, opens wider when it goes like that instead of just a straight zip. So... I'm just going to open it up and then show you guys an overall view of what's in there. Um, it holds a lot, but I put something really big in there. So it's taking up a lot of the space, which I will show you guys. But I don't mind because I got it like packed like as if I was going to go to work. So that's what I need in there. But if the item that I'm going to show you wasn't in there, you will have a lot more space. And I did order a purse organizer and I'll show you that when it's empty. Um, I just got it off of Amazon. Sorry, I have you guys, like, set up in a weird spot, but, um, this was super random. My husband's like, I'm gonna take the baby for a bike ride, and I'm like, oh, let me hurry up and film this, because I don't know when I'm gonna have a chance to film, so I just threw you guys right here in this little corner, because the rest of my room is dirty, but anyway. Um, if you guys saw my last video, I did a little girly haul, and I hauled this new Velvet Petals Untamed Body Mist by Victoria's Secret. It smells really good. And I just threw it right on top of, like, the bag. It's just sitting there so that I have my perfume with me for the day. So I have her in there. And then um, I also have my keys on this Victoria's Secret, um, like, little wristlet key holder thingamajiggy. And I just have my key on there and then, like, a little alarm button, panic button. Um, so this is the item that I was saying is really big and bulky and taking up a lot of space. And that is just my little, um, planner. I take this with me every day to work. Um, and I just have a pen there that I'm using. So this, um, I had it like in this back slot back here. So I could hold so much more. Um, if I wasn't going to use this as like my work bag, then I would put like more things in there. But right now I have my planner in there. Um, so that shows you how big the bag is. Like, it holds that huge planner. And then, along here, these are all lip products. And I'll show you guys those. And then I have some more over here. So I'm just going to pull those out. Um, I have my Hangover Pillow Lip Balm. I'm trying to finish it up. You guys can see, like, it's almost done. And then I have the newer, like, they came out with the Scented ones. This is the Watermelon one. Um, I've been using that too, and I'm still using my Marc Jacobs Coconut Lip Oil. I'm not sure if that's the right name. It says Recover Hydrating Lip Oil, and it's in shade 10, Kissability. Um, so yeah, I have those. And then I found this at the Dollar Store, um, and I've been loving it. It was at Dollar Tree. It's a Vaseline um, lip, lip therapy with cocoa butter, and it's so good, and I can't believe it was a dollar. I'm definitely going to pick some more of these up they're very hydrating um even my husband's been using it um so i've been using that and then i have one of my favorite scents from bath and body works in this like little glass um little perfume that they had when this first launched it's the wild madagascar vanilla which is discontinued now it only comes when they have like the bring back scents um but these they had at one time and I stocked up on them when they went. And they have like a little spray too. 
which is nice and it's a pretty big size it's not like a really really small size like this was $8.50 when they were selling it um, but I got them for like two something when they were on like a 75% off semi-annual so I picked up quite a few so I have all those I'm gonna just toss them on the floor um, so that is pretty much everything that was there I have nothing in there is a zipper on this organizer I don't have anything in it right now like here in the middle um, then on the other side I have my Steve Madden wallet i was keeping it with the steve madden vibes i guess um it's just this very pretty blush pink um little wallet and i guess i can open it you can't see too much so it has a lot of slots that's why i like it and then the it flips over and closes like that but then it also has like a zipper compartment on here and i just have more stuff in there this beautiful bedazzled starbucks gift card from Kimmy Lux Dolls on Instagram. And yeah. So I have my wallet in there. And then I have a hand sanitizer. This is from Victoria's Secret. It's the Mandarin Peach. And then we're moving on to one of the like back pockets. I just have some. I have a nail file. I keep my nail file. And I keep my nail glue um, in case my nails pop off. Um, usually if it pops off, I like to file the gel, like the glue that's on there down and make it smooth before I reapply. Because then it will just be like a lumpy mess if I put glue on top of glue. So that's why I have the nail file. And then I always keep a spare contact case in my purse in case my contacts mess up. If I'm out, I can pull them out and put my glasses on, which I always keep my glasses in here, but they're actually in my locker at work. I left them at work on the last day I was there, so um, that's where those are. And then I actually, in this back pocket, there's more pockets on the back of this organizer. I don't know if you can see right there. And I do have another card holder. Um, this is the one that I was using in my other purse, and I just left it in here to show you guys like more stuff fits, but I think I'm gonna just take the rest of the cards out and put them on the one that's on the outside of this bag and just put them in there but yeah so that's everything i'm gonna pull this out so you guys can see the organizer and like i said i will link it below i got it from amazon it was super cheap it was like 15 dollars and i just went on a whim and the size i picked was right i didn't even measure anything so this is what it looks like and they had more colors i wanted brown since the bag is brown and since this is like my fall bag i wanted a brown one um but this is what it looks like there's pockets here on the outside two pockets there's a pocket right here a slit and then all the pockets like here here one there the zipper another two and then this thing actually velcros and comes out. So if you didn't want all those pockets, they just wanted one deep pocket to put stuff, then you can take that out. It just has velcro on each side. I like it with the velcro. So yeah, so I will link this below. I don't think I can link the purse. I'll try and see if it's still on the Marshalls website. If I find it, I'll link it. But like I said, it's from Marshalls. You guys can go there. I, I feel like it's a newer bag. Because they have the tote style too. And the tote style comes with like a pochette. It's so cute. I have the tote too. I bought them both. But yeah, it's like, this is like a little speedy. So, that is everything I had in my bag. Oh, I wanted to show you guys. Um, I got some questions on um, one of my last skincare videos about um, what I was using. Because my face is like really clear. Because um, if you guys follow me, then you guys know that I had a lot of mask me. Um, I had a really clear face before the C word and then wearing my mask every day because I do wear it for like 12 hours a day at work and I just my face was like so messed up like all over like my cheeks my chin um, that whole area and it was like the kind of acne that would not go away it was so frustrating um, but I started you know switching up my skincare and I had found something that started working and I just continued with it. Um, I am all out of that cleanser, but, um, 
Hold up. First Aid Beauty actually just sent me a kit the other day. And it has the cleanser in there. So, I was using... So this is the kit they just sent me the other day. And this is the cleanser I was using. The Pure Skin Face Cleanser. This is such an amazing cleanser for anyone with sensitive skin. Um, like um, acne skin, oily skin, all skin types. It's just such a really clean, pure face cleanser. Like it really helps like with everything. Um, it says it removes surface oils, makeup, dirt, and grime. Safe for sensitive skin. I was using this nonstop every single day. Um, along with like a toner and their moisturizer in my face, I completely cleared up, not a pimple in sight. And, um, the only thing I have now is a few acne scars, like from the ones that were so, so like big and now I'm just using like stuff trying to clear up the little scars, but my face is completely clear and, um, everything's like, you know, no, it's just like a little texture. Um, but now I'm currently using, because like I said, I had ran out of that and they just sent me this smaller size, but when I ran out of my full size of this, I switched over to their, um, pure skin deep cleanser with red clay. And I like this one. This one's red. Um, it's really good too. It says it helps remove excess oil, unclogged pores and purify skin. If I had to choose, I would use the pure skin face cleanser. Um, I like this one a little bit more. I just like, um, I just like the way it like foams up and the smell of it and how clean my face feels. This one feels clean and everything too. I just, it doesn't really, um, foam up as much for me, but I, it is a deep cleanser and I am using this. I'm going to continue using this until it's up before I open this one since they just sent this one. I, I'm, I have so many face cleansers open right now. Um, I have another one from Peach Slices that they sent me recently, and I'm using one from Youth to the People. I just have so many open, so I don't want to um, open this one right now. I'm going to continue using this one, but this one's really, really good, too. Um, so I'm using, back to the point, they wanted to know what I was using right now. I'm using this right now. Um, I have this oil minimizing toner um, that First Aid Beauty also sent. And this one is like down to like right here. Um, so it's almost halfway. Um, I've been using that one. And this is the moisturizer. I feel like this moisturizer is really um, helping me too. This is, has Ultra Repair Cream Intense Hydration. And I didn't know this was for the face. Um, it just says Ultra Repair Cream. It didn't say anything about face cream. And it says used to help hydrate dry parched skin temporarily help relieve minor irritation and itching due to eczema and other conditions so I thought it was like a body cream and then I saw someone using it on their face so I was like I have that let let me try it and I've been using it um since and I feel like this plus the face cleanser the pure skin is what really like really really did it for my skin and like helped me so this is where I'm at right now I've been using this for at least, at least a good two months plus, and this is all, you only need a little bit. It's a really pretty thick cream, and that's the only much that is like, looks like I've used, but I've been using it for at least two months. It's crazy. I thought this would be empty by now, so that just shows you that a little goes a long way, and they actually, in this kit that they sent... Um, this is their holiday kit. Um, they just sent me another full size one. So I'm going to be um, using that for a good while. Which is great because it's like the only moisturizer I want to use on my face right now. It really, really leaves your face super, super hydrated and like moisturized. Like you can feel it as soon as you put it on there. But the thing with it is it doesn't break you out. It's like so good for sensitive skin. And if you have like clogged pores... You don't even have to worry that it's a thicker cream. Like, it doesn't matter because I have pores and it doesn't, like, make my pores look, like, any bigger or anything. So, I love that. But, yeah, this kit, um, it's in my last video, but I'll just show you guys again. It's called the Fab Skin Fortune. They have holiday kits and they're a really good value. Um, this, everything that's in here would normally cost, like, $95, $96 if you round it. And the kit will be $54. So, it is available, I think, on Sephora's website as well. 
and our first aid beauty so yeah so that's what i've been using for those who have been asking about my skin and all of that stuff of course was gifted to me by first aid beauty so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed um seeing what's in my bag i'm gonna put my organizer back in and put all my stuff back in there and have her ready i do have to go to work later today so i'll be taking this bag today finally i've been so excited to use it but yeah that's all i have for you guys um i hope you guys had a wonderful halloween yesterday was halloween and um yeah i don't know when i'm gonna post this today is november 1st happy november guys um maybe i'll post it today or i'll post it tomorrow we'll see but i just wanted to get it filmed for you guys since i had a little moment and I will see you guys on the next one, probably on Sunday. Alright, bye.